is Stephanie Hutchinson. I'm from Seattle, Washington, and I'm 22 years old. I'm studying human resource management and international business. That's enough for question one. On to question two. Skills. Um, you have my CD, CV, so you know my marketable skills are Microsoft Office, Business Administration, and German. Um, but as far as my unmarketable skills and my hobbies, uh, I'm, I love uh, playing little weird instruments. I play the ocarina, the guitar, and um, the piano all poorly, but I, I do dabble in that. <laughs> um, I also enjoy volunteering. I volunteer once a month with an organization called Flame. We do a local service project like weeding someone's garden or painting a house and uh, then we go it in the summer and um, spend two weeks doing similar things in other countries it's it's a lot of fun and you get to know a lot of cool people um, my other hobbies are baking I uh, often spend a whole weekend baking with my sister um, and as far as like cultural things that I'm into I listen to a lot of podcasts so everything from Freakonomics to news podcasts to um, podcasts that are just mostly about Beyonce. <laughs> um, so yeah, that, that takes a lot of my transit time when I'm going from one place to another, I listen to a podcast. So on to professional experiences. Last year, I worked at North Shore Sheet Metal. It's a manufacturing company. And what I would do there is I would process orders for manufacturer and manage the inventory. Processing orders for a manufacturer was uh, I collected emails and some other papers, filled out a form, and sent the, the order on to the next person, which is kind of a boring job, but um, it taught me a lot about it. The Microsoft skills. Um, I learned how to use Office and Excel better and I also learned how to do Access. Um, it also taught me how to deal with my coworkers. Um, I had never had a full-time job before so um, just figuring out how to like talk to, to somebody in a professional environment was uh, something I learned there. Also it helped me to learn how to optimize my workflow. Um, my job was relatively new so I just got a whole bunch of tasks to do and no order to do them in, so I figured out what, how I best worked and what I needed to do in what order. Um, so on to the last question, why Brazil? Well, I really am excited to get to know Brazil because I feel like it's a country in the middle of history. So much is happening in Brazil right now, I don't need to tell you about it, you know. Um, and I'm really excited to be a part of that. We always talk in a business school about the brick countries, and Brazil is obviously the first one in that. It's the best place to invest, but also a, a very risky place to invest, especially now. And I, um, I really, um, I don't like to be play it safe, but um, mostly I just think Brazil would be a lot of fun. Uh, I actually recently, in a podcast, learned that. Um, South American countries are the happiest on earth. Um, I hope you agree with that. Thanks. Talk to you later today.